Hi there, welcome to Food Trends TV. I am Dana McCauley. If you've been to the supermarket lately, you can't help but have noticed that there are tons of products out there that contain chia seeds. Now, chia seeds are a superfood that are known for being a good source of protein, a fantastic source of fiber, uh, very satiating, and, and really just generally good for us in so many ways, from heart health to diabetes to satiation. There's a good reason why people are excited about chia. What's interesting about Chia, though, is that it didn't race to the top. Uh, its trend curve is really, really interesting. About five years ago, the University of Toronto did a study that showed that Chia seeds were good for heart health. And there was tons and tons of information and buzz about Chia at that time. It was generally called Salvo, which was a brand name, but still it was Chia. There weren't a lot of products. Food scientists didn't know what to do with chia. There were other grains that were already uh, better developed as far as supply chain went. And chia just kind of fast forward a couple of years and we have all kinds of cool things out there. We've got gel type juices that are thickened with chia seeds. We've got breakfast cereals and morning, mid morning snack foods like this uh, oatmeal and uh, chocolate chip chia flavored quinoa granola bars, chia is every place. And what had to happen, and what is so common with a new superfood and a scientific breakthrough, is that supply and consumer knowledge had to catch up with scientific knowledge. And that's why chia has an atypical trend curve. Instead of going like this, its trend curve went up and down and up again. Thanks for tuning in to Food Trends TV. Our question of the week is, how do you feel about Chia? Are you incorporating it into your diet more often? Are you buying products like these? And if you are, how do you feel about these kind of thick juices? It's not my cup of tea, but they seem to be popular because there's a lot of them out there. So tell me what you think in the comment section below. Thanks very much, I'll see you next Monday. Please subscribe so that you don't miss the next episode.